Hey everybody, how you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do another collectible, collectible car club box. This one's going to be a little different though. Usually I get the baseball. This time I went and I got the three sport baseball, football, basketball box. And just to see what it's in it. Usually, again, there's 15 packs in a box. So there should be five packs for each sport. And I know football and basketball are a lot more expensive right now than baseball is so i'm kind of curious to see what's in here so without further ado let's say hi to the penguin let's bust this thing open and see what we find okay so here's the box so let's see here let's start with football and we'll see what we have in here so we have 2019 contenders oh here's basketball so it's going to be all over the place so 20 uh 2019 contenders for football uh, NBA Hoops for basketball, that's 21-20. Uh, Bowman Draft for baseball, that's 2014. Uh, 2019 Tops uh, Series 1. 2021 Opening Day. Um, we got a set of stickers, which I've seen before out of these boxes, so I'm not surprised. Uh, next little thing here. We have another package of hoops, uh, 2021 baseball, uh, 2004, and this is the draft edition of the Hot Prospects by Fleer, uh, 2020 uh, minor league tops heritage, uh, Hot Prospects 2006 hobby pack, we got a 2020 tops update of a 2011 Panini Threads, uh, 2014 Bowman Draft, and a 2018 Big League. So that's how they did it. They made most of it baseball and then gave you a few packs of football and basketball to go with it. So for, you know, $60, that's not bad. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to start off with the basketball since I really don't do a lot of basketball. And then we'll move to the football and the baseball. So again, we have two 2021 20, 20, 20, hoops and the stickers so we're gonna open the stickers first and watching some people open these they're not real easy to open without hurting things and I don't want to hurt anything so let's see what we get all right so we get Laurie Markin put him over here and then we've got Montreal Harrell, DeAndre Jordan, Jonathan Isaac, uh, Lonzo Ball, and rookie of Cameron Johnson. So there's the stickers. And then let's go to hoops. All right. So we have Eric Peschel, Danny Green. We have Mo Bamba, uh, Devin Booker, Victor Oladipo. Then we have a jersey swap of Rui Hachimura and Yuta Wannabe, Wantanabe. Uh, we have Anthony Edwards and uh, Sadiq Bey. So we have two rookies in here and the jersey swap. Next pack of hoops. Again, like I said, basketball is not really my thing. So let me know if I don't get if I get somebody and I miss them or something. So Jarrett Culver, uh, Frank uh, Mitten Lakina. Uh, let's see here, Montreal Harrell, Stephen Adams, Jaron Jackson Jr. We have an arriving now of. Alexei Puchuveski, I think, a rookie of Terrell Terry, and a rookie of R.J. Hampton. Okay, so that was the basketball part of this box. Now we're going to go to football. We've got Hot Prospects, Contenders, and Panini Threads. So let's open the Hot Prospects first.
All right, so hot prospects, we have an Anquan Bolden. I think I might have something. Is this a, might either have something in here or it's a blank. So let's do this. Uh, Edron James, Anquan Bolden, Steven Jackson, and then we have a, a, a rookie autograph of Mercedes Lewis, and it's stuck to something else. So a nice little four-piece uh, relic auto, sticker auto. And it's a auto rookie materials, so it's an RPA of Mercedes Lewis. And it is numbered 808 of 999. Okay, y'all can see that. So that's nice a nice little rookie materials, nice little patch auto there. There we go. And then the last card is an almond green by prospects. There we go. So that's one of the footballs. Then we have 2019 Panini Contenders. All right, and we have a Josh Allen, a Josh Norman, Miles Garrett. We have a Rookie of the Year Contenders of Miles Sanders. We have a winning ticket of Nick Foles, Sam Darnold, uh, Mitchell Trubu Tru Trubisky, and we have a Tyler Lockett. And there's our contenders, and then the Panini threads from 29 or 2011. Sorry, let's see what we get in here. All right, we have a rookie of Brandon Harris, uh, Matthew Stafford, Tony Gonzalez, Colt McCoy. We have an Aaron Foster, Josh Freeman, LaShawn, Mc LaShawn McCoy, Danny Amendola, and I think we've got a patch or an auto or something here. It's a thick one. And we have a franchise fabrics of Chris Johnson from uh, the Titans. So there you go. Nice little dual color uh, patch there. And that is numbered 7 to 50. So not bad. Nice little relic there. So, so far we're doing pretty good here. A football really came in, came in for us. All right, so next we go to baseball here, and let me get these in some kind of order that I want to open them in. Um, I want to be doing the Bowman draft first, so I'm definitely going to do that. Yeah, I think I'll do them like this. Okay, so here's the first Bowman Draft, 2014. And let's see if I can get into them. Maybe. Please. Let me open the package. Okay. Alright, so we start off with a first Bowman of Derek Hill. Then a first Bowman of... Corey Ray, then a chrome of Jorge Alfaro, a chrome of Trey Ball, a first Bowman of Dylan Davis, a Ramel Tapia, and a Jordan Luplo, first Bowman. So there we go. Oh, I forgot these. I accidentally set these to the side. The 20, uh, 2004 Draft Edition Hot Prospects cards. Let's see what's on here. says there's autos in some of these packages. I think I might have run across one, but we have a Miguel Cabrera and these are kind of stuck unfortunately. Hopefully not too bad. There we go. Uh, Rocco uh, Baldelli uh, Hot Tandems of Manny Ramirez and David Ortiz and then we have a backwards card here. I think this might just be a spacer and it is. 
uh, Tim Hudson, and Alfonso Soriano. So there we go. All right, back to the Bowman draft. Let's see. Nine. Yeah, we got 15 packs this time. That's cool. All right, come on. Open sesame. All right, first off here, we have a first Bowman of Dylan Cease. We have a Ryan uh, McMahon. We have a mini, uh, future of the franchise, uh, Blake Sweetheart. And that's going to be a Bowman Chrome. We have a Bowman Chrome first Bowman of Daniel Gossett. Uh, Jam, uh, Jameson Talon, Talion. It's a first Bowman Chrome. Then we have a Cole Stewart. And a first Bowman of Tajay and Tone. And there we go. We got that nice little mini there. All right, now we're gonna do 2019 Series One. All right, what we get here? We have a uh, Yomer Sanchez, Jose Quintana, Tyler Flowers. We have a Jackie Bradley Jr., Irvin Santana, a uh, Brandon Lowe. We have a Frank Thomas, 84 style. Uh, Joey Weddle, Wendell, Blake Snell, uh, Colin Moran, Adubo Herrera, Marcus S. Simeon, Trevor Williams, and we have a Branded Belt. So there's your 2019 Series 1. Now you have 2020 Big League, or 2018 Big League, excuse me. And again, most of these are hobby packs, if not all of them. Okay, we have a, a Garrett Cole, a Craig Kimball, Shohei Otani rookie card. So we'll go ahead and put him up there. Nice little Shohei Otani. All right. A John Smoltz. Uh, Paul Blackburn, rookie card. Jake Arrieta. Irvin Santana. Miguel Gomez, rookie. We have a Chris Davis, little um, star caricature, caricature reproduction card of Chris Davis. And then we have a gold or orange Mikel Franco. So there we go. We did get the Shohei Otani, so that's not bad. All right, now we got 2020 update. Let's see what we get in here. All right. Okay, we get a Michael Herman uh, Osio, a uh, Nick Turley rookie, a uh, Chislar Cuthbert, Gabe Spear rookie, Alex Verdugo. We get an Andrew uh, Kinsner, time to party, Taylor Ward. Donovan Solano. Here's an Austin Meadows. Nice little 85 style. Uh, Josh Fuentes. Max Scherzer. Jordan Lyles. And a Glaber Torres. Alright. Then we're going to move to Heritage Minor League from 2020. All right, so we have Andy Pages, uh, Nico Holsizer, uh, Louis Matos. Hey, there's a Ryan Mountcastle. So that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Nice little Mountcastle. Then we have an Evan White. So that's not bad either. Go ahead and put him up there. All right, then we have a Ryan Rolson. Hey, there's a Bobby Dalback. So we're kind of doing pretty good here. Good little, nice little class of rookies there. And then Aaron Bracho. Bracho, Bracho. I don't know. All right. 
Then we have 2021 opening day. I have not opened any of these yet. All right, we have a uh, Justice Sheffield, Josh Hader, Future Stars, a Blue Star Gratterall, a Jordan Alvarez. That'll go in the in the PC. Uh, Miguel Rojas. We have a Spencer Howard rookie, and then we have a Legends of Baseball, Ernie Banks. Here we go. Haven't seen those inserts. Okay. Then we have 2021 baseball. Uh, 2021 Heritage, excuse me. Um, I opened a box of this and was luckier than I thought I was. Uh, some uh, very nice people informed me that what I opened was a uh, hot box because everything had like a purple chrome card in it. So, um, yeah. Uh, Randall uh, Grichuk, uh, World Series Game 1, Charlie Blackman, Jacob DeGrom, Justin Smoke, Hey, we got another, look at here, we got another relic. And it's Gator Molina Clubhouse cl Clubhouse Collection. So there we go. Nice little relic there. Go ahead and put him right here. And then we have a Hunter Dozier. And we have a Rookies of Kybert Ruiz and Mitch White. So there we go. All right. So there's the... Uh, April version of the three sport collectible card club box. Uh, we did pretty good. Uh, we started a little bit slow with basketball, but we made it up with football and baseball. We got the rookie patch auto of. Um, let me get my glasses on. The rookie patch auto of Mercedes Lewis. The franchise fabrics of Chris Johnson. We got the Shohei Otani rookie card. We got the uh, Evan Travis. Out of Heritage, we got Bobby Dow back out of Heritage. We got Ryan Mountcastle out of Heritage. And then we got a Gator Molina Clubhouse uh, Collection Relic Card. So all in all, I think we did really good this uh, Collectible Card Club box. Um, I will have a baseball one coming in later this month, so we'll go ahead and do that one too. And before I leave, I just want to say something um, to kind of the state of what's happening lately. Um, I don't know if most of y'all know it, but I've seen, seen it in, on some channels and talking to some people. So this hobby is hard enough to get into and enjoy without infighting between channels or, you know, name calling or bad words or anything like that. So, um, I hope that what you're doing, you love doing it. Um, if you're doing it for the money, this kind of thing is not what you probably want to get into. Uh, the subscription boxes and the mystery boxes and the mystery packs, they're there to have fun, I believe. And they're there just for the, the thrill of finding something cool. Maybe something you wouldn't have opened before. Like the, the uh, 2011 threads. I probably would have never opened that. So... I hope, uh, I hope this helps. Like I said, if you're looking for an investment, you want to go ahead and you want to go somewhere else, say the Panini one or the Topps Inception or, you know, so, something that's not going to be um, a mystery of what you're going to get. You know? But if you like the mystery boxes and you like the collectible card club box or the Grand Slam box or any other of the other mystery boxes that are out there, um, I'll put the link in the description for the Collectible Car Club box, and whether you're going into it for an investment or going into it for the fun and the hobby of it, y'all have a good day, say bye to the penguin, and as always, happy break.